Okay, guys, so I'm gonna be real with you. Um, first of all, my phone's on selfie mode, so I'm really sorry about that. Like, I'm really not gonna make a high quality video right now, but I want to get a point across. So, earlier today, I've been, well, for the past, like, not month, but for, like, the past week, I have been binging so much. I was sick, so I didn't really eat, um before the new year okay so maybe it hasn't been a whole week yet but it's been close to a week it's been like four or five days i've just been binging straight up hardcore um ever since the 31st because i was sick for two to three days before that and i wasn't eating and i was like wow this is great because like i've been eating so much because of the holidays and now i'm sick you know that mindset that you have and then i had the 31st roll around and after that ever since then today's the fourth I've been eating like shit and completely horribly and I have to I have to be real with you guys because this is all about my journey too and I've been eating like an incessant amount of calories like unnecessary amount and then I realized I got to the gym I went and did an errand and then somehow I managed to take myself, I drove myself to Sonic, and if you guys don't know this, one of the main reasons why, like, one of the main reasons, though, that I gained all my weight was because I was eating, like, shit, and one of the places I was always eating at was Sonic. <sighs> I just want to put this out there, because for all of you that are struggling with binge eating, like, you are always going to be struggling with it, but the thing is, you can stop while you're ahead, so I ordered, like, $13 worth of food, I ordered... I can show you guys right here. I have this bag right here. I have, I ate one little chicky because I literally like caught myself. I realized right after I finished eating it and I went to, into the bag to get one more, another, and then there's not anything else more than that. But then there's mozzarella sticks. And there's jumbo popcorn chicken. And there's ranch in there. I went in and I was gonna I was gonna get more, not get more food, but like I was gonna eat more of what I had ordered. And I was like, holy crap, Cindy, like why are you doing this to yourself? And then I had that mental moment where I was like, oh, I'll finish it and then I won't binge. You guys, this is one of one of the biggest things I'm gonna tell you. I'm not gonna eat any of this. What I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna just like drive around the city and I know you don't always have homeless people where you live, but, like, at least where I live, like, people beg at night, um, on the side of the road, and I'm just gonna give them this food, because two things. Number one, I, I would even toss it out, but, like, because I have the opportunity to give it to someone, like, that's what I'm gonna do, but the moment that you realize that you're binging or that you're eating something that you shouldn't be eating, just fucking spit it out. Don't throw it up if you've already swallowed it, because that's a completely different eating disorder, and it becomes, like, a mental thing. But, like, if you haven't swallowed it yet and you're chewing it and you're like, holy crap, I'm eating something that I really don't want to be eating, it doesn't feed my goals, don't finish chewing it, don't put more in your mouth, get rid of it. And that's one of the biggest things that I just, I've been struggling with so hardcore because I just, I eat and then I, I regret it later and, you know, the only good thing I got was water. This is water right here, so I'm going to take a drink of it, but, like, I literally drove myself here I drove myself away from my goals basically right after the gym and I gotta be real with you guys the past four days I've been eating horribly but I mean you know every day is a new day every second is a new second so if you're struggling with eating properly or if you're just struggling in general with, you know, making the right choices, remember that every second is a new second. You can make a different choice. You don't have to continue doing what you're doing. You can make the change right now. You might have binged all day today. If you guys are watching this and you guys went through something like that, just know that every second is a new day. Every second is a new second. Every day is a new day. Every week is a new week. But don't ever tell yourself you're going to start doing it after or tomorrow because that will never happen. Start, if you're that serious about it, start now. So I just, you know, I really screwed up tonight, you guys. Like, I didn't screw up because I saved myself from it, but I just wanted to show you guys this because like this was one of my weak moments and you know, we're all human. So I hope that you guys enjoy like this video and I love you guys. New year, cheers to 2018, better Sydney. And um, yeah, I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. 
All right, guys, that wraps up another video in this series, New Year, Better Me. I hope that you guys enjoy. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on my Snapchat, my Instagram, hit me up, leave a comment down below, and just, you know, sound off. Love you guys.